What's up guys, welcome back to our next showcase and this time we'll be talking about the newly released Star Platinum The World Requiem. And uh, today we'll be going through all its skill set including the skill tree and what I recommend for you to use uh, with Star Platinum The World Requiem. So let's get right into it. Let's have a look at Star Platinum The World Requiem skill tree. As you can see it looks like a star. This might be confusing to some. But don't worry, I'll explain. This skill tree costs a grand total of 70 points to max, and there's two branches or two main branches in this skill tree: time-related moves and damage. So let's go through damage first. As you can see down here, you have destructive power, which goes all the way to level five, as well as destructive power three branches off to stand jump, which also goes up to level three, as well as branching off to two new moves such as aura beatdown and platinum slam. Down here, you have combat position, and that goes up to level 3. And then over here, you have the time branch, which goes by time stop resistant first, time skip, which branches off to skull crusher, and then you have the world, and then finally, time stop mastery 1 and 2. Quite a simple skill tree. A battle position for Star Platinum the World Requiem. In this state, he gains speed buff, defense buff, as well as hyper regen. Not only so, all his blocks become instant parries, meaning that heavy punches will be perfectly blocked, as well as all other attacks that can break block. Press H to activate Time Stop. Unlike Star Platinum before Requiem, this Time Stop does not require the user to have rage to be used, but acts like abilities such as Conqueror's Will. Press C to activate Aura Beatdown. It's self-explanatory. This is me getting beat down to show you how much health it takes away without any spec. I am using Harmon in this shot. But uh, I have not charged any, so this is how much damage you would take normally. Just to let you guys know, I also have max vitality in this clip. So far since this video is recorded on the day that this stand was released, I did not have that much experience with the specs for this stand. However, I am right now running Hormone and that seems to be working out. I'm pretty sure Boxing is also a good choice. I would pick Boxing and Hormone just because you get extra uh, extra barrage, right? You get extra health from Boxing and you get, you know, buff defense from both Tough Skin and Hormone defense. And with Hormone, you get bonus damage. So yeah. Also, um, you can try Vampire if you want to, just because it offers stun moves with its freeze and, you know, bl life drain. Uh, that's because Star Platinum the world does not have Star Finger and Star in Hell, unlike Star Platinum, which allows, you know, less immobility moves to stop the enemy from running around. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching my showcase. Um, it's been a blast filming it for you guys. If there's any suggestions on the next stand I should showcase, please comment below. And until then, peace out, guys.